Exploding out of the blocks here and they look to run from deep and it's lovely play, beautifully picked up there. Little chip ahead, sprint on here, flying through the middle, goes Hodge, if he can control it, could finish this. But taken down, try scored anyway by Monda. The Chiefs have two and two. Shay feeding off there. Lovely nuts through. Hodge felt he was impeded, but it didn't no, matter. Fine. All from the restart, well taken. And looking to attack from deep on if this anything, first phase ball. It was ball. you on them, it wasn't them on you. Simmons to Slade. All clear. And wrapped in by Cordero onto that left boot. Beautifully weighted kick through. Right. And Hodge flying. Exeter recycling via Yosefa Scott, and it's opening up here, and Slade, and then Hogg. Oh, if he can keep his feet, he didn't, but he still managed to have the wherewithal to find Slade, and in the blink of an eye, and some snappy hands, Exeter score. That's what they've been missing. That's what they found. Lovely hands out the back there, and then they're just going round, and they get that gap between players that are tired and have been battering away at the defensive line and the yeah. slightly fresher forwards and absolutely tear Henry. a hole Henry. in it. Brilliant from Hogg to get through and to stay alive and get Thank the ball you. out the back door to Slade. Tony Oosthuizen took it in, oh, and then it's charged down by Will Whitty and the lumbering giant trying to control this football style and somehow yes. he has, like a large tree, he somehow manages to keep that ball at his beck and call. That is the single most beautiful thing I have ever seen on a rugby field. A big, bald man using his skills. Look at them trying to get back. They can't get near him. Lovely control picks up. Timber. That is the try of the season. Shut the book. <laughs> Stick a red shirt on him. Send him to Anfield. Kickoffs in a couple of minutes. He'll be all right. Simmons outrageous dummy, he's gone. Oh, he's going. He's broken a couple of tackles. He's hit the deck, got that up and still made it. But for anybody he's got to him. Low centre of gravity, extreme pace. This one, nothing like the first. This one about evasion skills, power and pace. Speed back to his feet. Lovely dummy. Oli Morris can't do much about that, he's beaten, Shilcott beaten. Hits the deck, back on his feet, no one can get to him. Good. Capstick inside for Ewers. Great support line as well. Terrific work from the Chiefs, this. And Slade is away to the corner. One shot, one try. All good. Was. Just got beaten with those inside passes, really nice those support that, lines. Dave, really nice that They've been putting a lot of pressure the through the ball carrier, the ball, but a couple of brilliant. little offloads. Was be, be disappointed. They got that territory and gave away early pens. They got man down in the backfield as well. Here's Hendrickson, Skinner, Hogg on the wide outside. Cordero. He's going to take on Watson. That's brave. He's got Watson's number. Lightning pace in the from so Facundo in the Cordero time. for all money. What did I say to you before? Marcus Watson is not usually a man you would take around the outside. And in top flight rugby, Hidalgo Klein is on for Maunder as well. And away goes Simmons from the base, charging through. One result, it's the familiar result. And once again, the spark for Exeter, their number eight. All too easy, and just have another look at this. When he grabs the ball out of the scrum, he, he holds it with one hand, so there's no sight of where he's coming or when he's coming. Ball at the back there, look at the explosive power he's got. Nizam Kar, look, he's beyond Watson, Nizam Kar uh, before he can even one. think or do anything about it. That's just pure speed. Start for him today. Hendrickson again, oh, he's bowling ball his way through, and Hogg's there to complete the strike job.
wonderful, wonderful trickery there. He's been so powerful, so direct, and so strong through contact. Doesn't even need to take contact. And then connects with Hogg. It's a really, really good score. No. Lighting fires. Still going score. No. On the inside shoulder, half break. Step off the right foot to break that tackle. In she goes from Munda. It's with Simmons. Here's Simmons. Clutch range. No contest. It had to be. Thank you. Absolutely lethal from that sort of range. The ball so quick. And the man so destructive. The Bath back row, look at them. They've got no choice but to stay down. If they don't stay down, then... They are toast, they will be pushed off the ball. Look at Ellis, he's got to stay down. And by the time Simmons is already over the line, by the time he's even got up. But that's not just about the pace and the explosiveness of that man, Sam Simmons. It's also about the extra eight working hard. Shoves Alex Good out of the way. More penalties, Hogg. Simmons looking for O'Flaherty, a battle in the air, one by O'Flaherty. The brilliance of the kick, the quality of the catch, a minute to half time, maybe that's the Chiefs' first try. They recycle, see the opportunity, and then this kicks on the money. It has to be because it's yeah, a I'm happy. Thanks, mate. Thank you. competing in the air, and O'Flaherty gets All good, Luke. above Not Alan clearly, Davis. Fun. It's a great score, isn't it? Flats, he does well actually to stay behind Simmons with a kick and just blindsides him, doesn't he? Hill, Maunder, Simmons, but beyond him to Devoto, to the other Simmons now, and Slade was rocketing towards that. Noel, really nice. Hogg gathering, has held to the left with O'Flaherty. That is magical. Happy New Year, Exeter. Oh, if 2022 is full of moments like that, then Exeter, in particular, will be very happy. That was a gem. Well, you know what? That's the way to welcome in your new stand with a try with that sort of quality. Sometimes you can be critical of defence and look at reasons why tackles are missed, but also you have to applaud the attack. Beautiful rubber kick off his right boot, bouncing end over end and almost sits up perfectly for Hogg. Didn't have to break stride. And once he gets the ball to a flat tee, it's a wonderful score. Brilliant attack from Exeter Chiefs. Release the ball in it. Simmons chips through. Should be a chase here for Woodburn. He will catch and score. Simplicity itself from the Chiefs. And now the scoreboard reflects their dominance. And the yellow card of Billy Twelve Trees proving ever more costly. Maunder would burn back inside. A little pass through there from Maunder. Maunder has Hendrickson in support. He also has a 30. There's the try bonus. Jack Maunder with the break. A 30 with the finish. Well, the question was, was there a definite obstruction? I would say from that angle, absolutely not. Ewers gives it to Whitten quickly and now Hodger and he's got some space and he's going to take some stopping. No one's going to stop him. He is rapid and he's been fabulous in the first quarter of this match. And he thoroughly deserves that try. What a start he's had to this game. Just as Matt Ferguson was talking about Northampton num numbers being sucked in an attack, that time they were sucked in in defence. Big Dave Viewers is such a threatening ball carrier. You have to stick on him, you have to. Ball goes out the back, Hodge just beats the man. Beats him before he gets there, steps inside Tom Collins, makes it look so simple. What a ball carrier he is, wonderful. Tom Collins hasn't got a chance. He's gone before he gets there. Just overruns it, Collins, doesn't he? <laughs> yep. Gets on the outside shoulder too early. 
Like you said, this guy has got some gas. Mourned at Simmons, the cross kick that was coming. And, oh, oh it's brilliantly taken. Take. Plucked out on the boundary by Ollie Woodburn. That is sensational. To add to a lengthy list of the sensational yeah, really good, good in this good. contest. Just fantastic. He's looked at it. He spots it, it's a pre-call, but this is a sensational catch on the move. Absolutely at full stretch, dots it down, brilliant finish. He's got James Grayson in his left ear hole as well. Oh, in the did, he, line. did he? Did he? Oh no, Nick, what have you seen? Yeah, no, nothing. Yeah, no, no. no, he's fine. It's the bonus point securing try. Advantage. Simmons looking to exploit it, Hogg to O'Flaherty, through the tackle of Quirk, O'Flaherty still on his feet somehow or other, Munda, catch stick, Simmons again, Hendrickson straightening beautifully, deep inside the 22, Munda, Sam Munda using Woodburn, try, something of a lightning strike from Exeter, from behind halfway, First the scrummage, then the burst from O'Flaherty, and Woodburn with the finish. Well, I tell you what, we talked about the Chiefs needing a fast start. That is as good a try as you'll see. There was a lot to admire in that. Extra have lost a couple of yards, but they'll keep hold of that ball. Simmons over the top, brilliant. As Bath throughout the line, Spencer flew up. Hold fees for Mullen. Chiefs are in the corner. A lovely ball from Simmons, a defensive misread from Ben Spencer. Okay. Ollie very nicely done. I think that's what you get when, when Chiefs hold the ball for long, long, you know, phases of play. Um, opportunities will, will come, and I think, you know, we saw that there with, with the lovely float ball over the top, Jack Vermeulen in the corner. Um, I think Chiefs, again, will just be looking to keep the ball as much as possible because Bath have got, you know, these, these big abrasive forwards that if you can keep them running around, um, you know, holes will open. Oh, Flaherty, well tackled, brilliant offload to Stuart Hogg, who's away through the middle, they cut Bath in half, there's no one there for him to give the ball to, very clever kick, Schickling, flying down the left, it's a foot race, he's made it, if he scores it'll be sensational, he hasn't scored it, the Chiefs have retained the ball, that would have been a wonderful try, Dave Ewers, who else, arrives and does the job, sensational from Stuart Hogg, from Patrick Schickling, and just a great engine from Dave Ewers to finish off a brilliant try, Oli, brilliant. The pace from Big Pat. Flying. Spencer did well, but Will Stewart caught Nappy, needed to hit in on Stewart Hall. Oh, fine. Not that he would have got there, that's too much to ask. Fifth time they've been into the 22, ball in hand. These balls out. tackles are flying in every which way, and... Saracens having to be absolutely on point. Here's Witten, pops that one up and breaking forwards is Woodburn. That is a fine try. Ollie Woodburn did so well. The angle was a good one. The balance was magnificent. And Exeter okay. take the lead at the Stonex. How about this for a little line? Just on the angle, Tompkins, who's normally so reliable defensively, he misses a tackle, sliding and... As you say, Woodburn going one way and then steps back off the other foot. Good work, thanks, Mo. This might be the last pool game of the uh, the rugby, but they are absolutely going hammer and tongue here. And this, it might not be a final, but it looks like one. Stuart Hogg, little bit of space, and he creates some more with a wonderful sidestep. He's got support inside, gives the pass. Sam Maunder with the try. That should seal it for the Chiefs. And you see what it means to them. Means to the fans, means to the players, and means to the club. And it's scoring a try of that quality against the quality of opposition as well that will mean so much.